If you're an accountant practice and your IT systems are old and need updating, what is the best and most cost-effective way that you can modernize your IT setup? Well, that is what today's video is all about. But before we start, a quick introduction. My name is Jonathan Edwards and I'm a business IT consultant from Yorkshire in the UK. We help businesses with their IT support and the cyber security. So we're an IT provider who specialize in working with accountants. So we're often tasked with designing new IT systems for lots of our accountancy customers. We've got some clients who run their entire practices through the cloud. You've got some clients who have servers in their office. So what is the best way to set up the IT for your practice? Well, the simple answer is, it depends. It depends on a few factors. Factors like how many offices does your accountancy practice have? What is your growth strategy? What is your attitude to remote working? And what is the practice management software solution that your accountancy uses? Now, I'm gonna talk about each of those factors in turn. But before I do, I just want to point out two things. Firstly, there's always a lot of pressure to seemingly move with the times. Cloud computing is the new thing and every accountancy should be moving all their IT to the cloud. That's not always the case. It's not always cost effective to do that. I'll explain a little bit later. And secondly, when I talk about moving to the cloud, I'm talking about your business applications, things like Iris and Sage and CCH. I'm not talking about email. When it comes to email, everybody should just be using Microsoft 365. So the first factor that I want to consider is the number of offices that your accountancy has. If your accountant practice just has a single office, then moving to the cloud will cost you a lot more money than having a server. Let's have a look at a few numbers. So you've got an accountancy with one office. You've got 25 computer users. A server solution for your business is gonna cost about 15 to 20,000 pounds. That's gonna be a one-off cost. And that cost and that solution is gonna last you for five years. Now let's look at the same setup, but with a cloud solution. So you've still got 25 users, you've still got a single office. A fully cloud solution is gonna cost you the minimum of 50 pounds per user per month. Now it's a different cost model and that cost model might be attractive to you. But if you look at those numbers over a period of five years, it comes to about 75,000 pounds. So it's 75,000 pounds versus 20,000 pounds. That's a big cost difference. So what if you've got an accountancy practice with multiple officers? Perhaps you've got two officers or 10 officers. Well, each person in each office still wants to share the same applications and the same kind of storage solutions. So it might not be practical to stick a physical server in one of the offices and then each different office connects that server. So in that case, moving to the cloud might be your best option. The second factor that I want to talk about is your firm's growth strategy. Are you looking to buy other accountancies? Are you building your accountancy up to be acquired? Let me tell you a quick example. Several years ago, we had an accountancy customer and we designed them an IT solution that involved installing some servers in their office. We were happy with this design and it was gonna last them for five years. And we put a little bit of leeway in there for growth. Now, out of the blue, they called us up one day and they told us they'd just bought another accountancy. This effectively doubled the size of their practice. Now, this caused a little bit of an IT headache because we had to try and squeeze that other accountancy into this IT solution. If we'd known about this growth strategy in advance, if we'd known that they wanted to buy other accountancies, then we might well have designed a fully cloud-based system. Because with a cloud-based system, you can just easily bolt on additional resources. And what about the other side of that? What happens if you're building your accountancy practice up to sell? In my opinion, having a cloud solution will be much more attractive to a buyer because it's not static. You've not got lots of servers in a physical location. That new buyer might want to close your office or move it somewhere else. All really achievable with a cloud solution, not so easy with a server solution. Plus, they can just increase and reduce resources just like the other example I gave you. The third factor that I want you to consider 
is your approach to remote working. Now, obviously, we've just come out of the other side of a pandemic. We've got some accountancy practices who have gone back to working exactly as they did before. Everybody is back in the office. But we've got one client with 30 users who have fully embraced the remote working. So when it came to design an IT solution for them, it wasn't cost that was a driving factor. It was that ability to work effectively wherever they were, just as long as they had an internet connection. So what is your approach to remote working? That's a big factor when designing your next IT solution. The final factor that I want you to consider is the business software that you use to run your accountancy practice. There are now lots of providers in the accountancy world like Caseware and Silverfin. These offer fully cloud-based services and it means that you don't need a server in your office or in the cloud to run it. It's all run over an application or a web browser. There are also lots of applications in the accountancy world, like CCH for example, where it's still your responsibility to run that software. Now I realise that changing software is not an easy thing. Perhaps your accountancy practice has been using CCH or Iris for many, many years. Everybody in the business knows how to use it. You can't just change it overnight. It's a big, big task. But in my opinion, you've always got to look out for how you can make your business more flexible. And that is by embracing software as a service solutions. So it might not be something for this year, but you've got to have it in your plans. Now, I hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope it's given you some food for thought. As I say, we specialize in supporting accountancy practices. So if you've got any questions, just reach out to us.